I'm talking with Coach Real after a two-point loss to Hamilton Heights Christian Academy. Uh, they've only lost the one game this year. Uh, last year and this year, they've been incredible. And honestly, a team that I didn't know that any traditional high school like yourselves could even compete against. Uh, so tell me a little bit about, though it was a loss, how you guys saw you play. Um, you know, we had our spurts. Mm -hmm. We knew coming in that they could score a bunch of points. Uh, balls, and, and Big Sam, and Jatobo, I mean, those three, they can, they can score. Just a matter if we could withstand their run, get a bucket here or there. And, and we did that. Just defense, we had just a few missed Giving up 10 offensive rebounds. You're not going to win ball game. Uh, going into a game like this, you see, I mean, they have a like 16 16 front line. Um, did you believe you could get, I mean, Rodney played well and Colin played well on the post for the most part, from my perspective? Yes, sir. Did you think they could do that? Oh, yes, sir. Definitely. <coughs> um, you know, to Corey Brooks. Broke his nose last week, so not having him out there, we just said, okay, this is what we're gonna do. Um, maybe the best job they could do. <coughs> Colin and Mason are wing perimeter players, you know, so you're telling them to go down there, guard these guys. That's all they do is get down there and bang them. So. And then last thing, tell me about uh, first quarter, especially from Sly Thompson, uh, Jefferson Walker. Uh, is that typical for them? I mean, they played incredible opening. Yes, yes sir. Yes. That's what they do. I tell coaches all the time, you know, everybody wants to know what can they do because, you know, they don't wow you with dunks or just super speed. Uh, you're not with loss, but both of those guys, they just know how to win. Yeah. You know, they get you in situations where you have opportunity to win. Uh, and that's what they did in the first quarter. They saw me some big shots, made some big moves. And Jeff, I mean, he was just phenomenal. And yeah. We went down there. Uh, Four City, Arkansas, the rum on the ridge earlier. He, he was five for seven behind the three. So, yes, he's, he's been putting up buckets. Yeah. I really appreciate your time. Um, thanks for hosting, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. But uh, Barla High School, Coach Real. Thanks, man. Thank you.